Her brand, Lemmy, which launched in September 2022, offers a line of gummy vitamins that promise various wellness benefits, from helping you relax with Lemmy Chill to boosting concentration with Lemmy Focus. The latest edition, Lemmy GLP-1 Daily, is marketed as an herbal alternative to GLP-1 agonist prescription drugs like Ozempic and Wegovy that have gained massive popularity for their weight loss effects. While these medications have been lauded for their ability to help people shed pounds, they have also sparked debate over their side effects and the ethics of their widespread use. Kardashian Barker now joins the conversation by offering a non-prescription supplement she claims could help manage hunger and cravings without the downsides of prescription drugs. But is this new product just another hype, or does it have real potential? GLP-1 agonists, including drugs like Ozempic, Wegovy, Majaro, and Zepbound, are part of a class of medications that have transformed the weight loss industry. These drugs contain active ingredients such as semaglutide and terzepatide that mimic the hormone GLP-1 glucagon-like peptide-1. This hormone plays a critical role in regulating hunger by telling the brain when you're full, which in turn helps reduce overeating. It also helps balance blood sugar, making it a popular choice for people with type 2 diabetes. For individuals struggling with obesity, GLP-1 agonists have shown remarkable results. After years of clinical trials, these drugs have been approved by the FDA, demonstrating their effectiveness and safety. However, they come with notable side effects, including nausea, gastrointestinal issues, and, in some cases, more severe complications. Despite this, demand for these drugs has soared, making them hot commodities in the $76 billion diet industry. Lemmy GLP One Daily positions itself as a natural, over-the-counter alternative to these weight loss drugs. The supplement, set to be available for $72 a month with a subscription, claims to contain herbal ingredients that may enhance the body's natural production of GLP-1. This could help reduce hunger and cravings, supporting healthy weight management over time. The promise of a natural solution, without the severe side effects associated with prescription drugs, is undoubtedly appealing. However, there is an important distinction between Lemmy GLP-1 Daily and prescription GLP-1 agonists. The supplement is not FDA approved. Supplements, unlike pharmaceutical drugs, do not go through rigorous clinical trials to prove their efficacy or safety. Instead, it's up to the companies themselves to ensure their products are safe, but they are not required to prove any scientific benefit before they hit the market. In a statement to Business Insider, the brand emphasized that the supplement's ingredients had been tested in humans. While the supplement may boost natural GLP, one production, there's little conclusive evidence that these herbal ingredients can effectively manage weight loss in the same way prescription drugs do. Speaking to Vogue Dr. Kathleen Valentin, Kardashian Barker's personal doctor and part of the medical team behind Lemmy Supplement, has helped develop a formula based on three plant-based ingredients. Arimin Lemon Fruit Extract, Suppressa Saffron Extract, and Morisil Red Orange Fruit Extract. According to Dr. Caroline Messer and Dr. Kumar, who regularly prescribe weight loss drugs, these natural ingredients show some promise. For example, Iriamin and Morisil have been studied and found to impact pathways similar to GLP-1, which is involved in regulating appetite. However, the doctors remain cautious, noting that these ingredients haven't been extensively tested together or compared to synthetic alternatives used in conventional weight loss treatments. Kardashian Barker, in an interview with Vogue, explained her reasoning behind launching Lemmy GLP-1 daily. She acknowledged the benefits of GLP-1 medications, noting that they have been helpful to so many people. However, she also pointed out the downsides, particularly the side effects, which include extreme nausea and digestive issues. Kardashian Barker said she received numerous direct messages from people asking for a gentler alternative, which spurred her and her team to explore a solution. For me, this product was never just about weight loss, Kardashian Barker told Vogue. Kardashian Barker adds that she hasn't tried the supplement herself because it's not approved for individuals who are currently breastfeeding. For many consumers, Kardashian Barker's endorsement lends credibility to the product. She has built a brand around wellness and clean living, which resonates with a broad audience. But at the same time, her involvement also highlights a larger trend the merging of celebrity influence with the booming wellness and supplement industry. Consumers are increasingly turning to celebrity-backed products, 
often without realizing that these products do not have the same regulatory oversight as pharmaceuticals. Kourtney Kardashian Barker is sharing one of her parenting secrets. Appearing on Dear Media's The Skinny Confidential podcast, the mom of four opened up about how she's practiced co-sleeping with all four of her kids. Kardashian Barker shares her kids Penelope, 12, Mason, 14, and Rain, 9, with ex Scott Desick and son Rocky, 13, 10 months, with husband Travis Barker. I'm on the craziest hours right now because of our whole summer of touring, but I think one thing too is that we sleep with our baby, Kardashian Barker said on the podcast. As a mother, I like to do what feels natural and instinctual to me. And that's for me what it is, Kardashian Barker explained of co-sleeping. And of course, I also read all the benefits and hear all the benefits. And I mean, it's something that mammals have been doing for since time existed. Asked if there's an age limit for co-sleeping, the Lemmy co-founder said that she doesn't impose restrictions. I think every person's different, and every child is different. My oldest son slept with me till he was seven and just naturally wanted to sleep, she said of her son Mason. I mean also part of it like at a certain time, I would put him to bed in his room, and then he would come to my room. That's what my daughter does. She comes in. And then at seven he just stopped and he was like, I'm done with you. I sleep in my own room. And then my daughter slept with me pretty much till she was one one. Why husband loves it too, adds Kardashian Barker. So we get aligned. In 2018, Kardashian Barker got candid on her website as she explained why co-sleeping had become second nature in her household. Getting the kids to sleep through the night in my home was different for each individual child. She began. When I had Mason, co-sleeping just kind of happened naturally. It's what worked for all of us to get the most sleep, so I quickly embraced it. But it was also really important to me to research the benefits and some of the criticisms when it came to this method, added Kardashian Barker. I also used certain things like the Dake Tot, which gave me more peace of mind. But once Penelope was born, the mom of four had to make a few adjustments. She explained, when I had Penelope, I read the attachment parenting book by Dr. Sears and this style of co-sleeping really worked for us. During this time, Mason was also sleeping most nights in my bed, Kardashian Barker wrote. We made it work and I really just followed his lead for when we both felt he was ready to sleep in his room, 